What's up, YouTube? Handlebar Mike here with an absurd pipe video. <laughs> I just wanted to hop on real quick this morning and show you guys this big, beautiful 15 inches of Turkish Meerschaum that I have recently acquired. Uh, this is by far the most absurd and impractical pipe that I own, but I absolutely love it. I uh, recently put a moratorium on buying pipes. I decided I have enough at this point <laughs> and I uh, canceled all my uh, my watches, <laughs> all my, uh, my searches on eBay at this point and uh, decided I did not need to buy any pipes. Uh, the only thing that I was still looking at was this that I was watching because I wanted to see what it would go for. Uh, it had an obscenely low starting bid of $19.99. No bids on it when I first saw it. It did have a buy it now for like $119 or something like that. And I was looking at a bunch of Meerschaum stuff, just for price purposes and, and you know, satisfy my my itch to know what these things go for price-wise. So I had I was watching this and I said, well, let me see where it goes. Well, five minutes before the auction ended, nobody bid on this. So I threw my hat in the ring for 20 bucks. This thing, including shipping, cost me $29. Now it is vintage, I believe. I don't know much about it. There is no uh, carver's marks or, or signatures or anything on it. It is Meerschaum. It is a full 15 inches long. Uh, the stem breaks down into three separate pieces. The bowl is separate. The bit itself is separate as well. It has a big, big bowl, and it was unsmoked. This is the first bowl that this pipe has ever had through it. Mm -hmm. Look at them. Mm -hmm. Big old square jaw. <laughs> um, I'm a big fan of smoking pipes. Uh, now, I'm a big fan of, of, of not... Um, letting unused pipes uh, sit. You know, I, I believe that pipes should be smoked just like I believe old cars should be driven. Um, it's just the way I am. Each their own. I have no problem with you. Uh, if you want to collect pipes that are unsmoked and not smoke them, that's fine. But they're a tool. <laughs> they're an enjoyable tool. Might as well use them. I absolutely love the absurdity of this. It, it is massive. It's impractical. Um, it's stupid. But 29 bucks, I'm all over it. I'm all over it. <laughs> It smells pretty good. The bowl is huge. You can get quite a bit of tobacco in that bowl. It smokes lovely. The draw is a little tight, but other than that, it is just absolutely incredible. So I wanted to share this experience with you guys <laughs> because it is so damn absurd. eBay deals are real. Gotta be careful. Stay away from the bay. Because <laughs> you'll wind up with more pipes than you ever need. Especially stupid, crazy pipes like this. Mm -hmm. I can't wait for the fall to come around and sit around a campfire <laughs> with this monstrosity. <laughs> all regal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Some other updates, by the way, guys. I think I have my box pass all sorted out. Watch uh, the channel for a video early next week if you want to participate in my subscriber box pass. I have the list of tobaccos. I've, I've pulled everything out. I think I have everything ready to go uh, for that box pass. So we will pull the trigger and get that thing started as far as getting signed up on it, at least. Uh, also, I have um, made a, a relatively silly list of uh, of tips for newbies. Basically, uh, what I want to do is create a video, create a video basically where I address myself <laughs> when I was a new pipe smoker. So uh, just some things that I came across that I struggled with as a new, a new pipe smoker. Again, very lighthearted. Trust me, it's not going to be a very big, heavy how-to or anything like that. So if you guys are looking for that, I do apologize. It's going to be much more lighthearted and fun just because <laughs> that's the way I am. Uh, with that, guys, have a great rest of the day. Uh, don't forget, pack a bowl, light it up, burn it down, relax, enjoy. I'll see you guys online next time.